Hello, my amazing subscribers, and welcome, newcomers. I am Carnage, the creator, and welcome back to Survivor Land Adventures with me and my buddy Bandit over here. Man, we've been getting up to some crazy adventures, isn't that right, Bandit? We get up to all the adventures, all the survival -y stuff. We've got so much stuff going on here. I mean, we haven't been at this world for all that long, and we've got farms. We've got a sheep farm over there. We've got an awesome house over here, the House of Carnage, and um, I don't know. I just, I'm very proud of how this world turning out and I really just cannot wait to see what the next day brings but for today I do believe I've got some ideas to kind of spruce up our house a little bit further than how we've got it so far I think what I want to do which I I think I actually have the stuff yeah I've got oak wood already I think I have enough but um what I want to do is I want to grab some oak wood and I want to put some buttons on the outside of the house so we're gonna put some buttons on the outside of the house but before we do that Bandit you're gonna sit right there and I'm gonna come in here I'm gonna shear all these sheep I'm not quite sure if I even need any of this wool right now but oh Oh, wait a second. Oh, I just got a brilliant idea. Oh, I just got a brilliant idea. Hold up. I'll be right back, sheep. I'll be right back. Come on, bandit. I've got an idea, and it might just be the best idea I've ever had in the entirety of this series. First off, we got to check to make sure we don't need any more wool, and if we don't, then man, oh man, do I have an idea. We're going to come inside here. We got to look around and make sure we got all the wool done. We got this back part done. I know we got the sides part done. I think we're good on wool bandit. It is time for us to do something I've been wanting to do. I've been saying this for so, so long that I've wanted to do this. So, today's the day that we get to do this. It just popped into my head. Oh my gosh, look at it. We're gonna grab some lapis. We're gonna have... Oh my gosh, I can't wait for this. We're gonna have some blue sheep. I've been waiting for this day for so long. And you know, we can really use the blue uh, wool anyway because we need to put carpet inside of our house instead of all that wood that's there. So, we're gonna go ahead and come on out here. And you know what? I'm not even gonna mess around. Every last one of these sheep are about to be blue. I know it sounds crazy, but I'm gonna do it. We're just gonna have every single last one as blue. <laughs> They're all look at them. Oh man, I can't believe I just did that. I probably used way more. I probably should have like did it to like one of them and then breeded them. But you know what? We had tons of lapis, so I'm just gonna hang on to this stuff. I mean, it's all over the world. We can always look for more and stuff like that. So eventually, um, you know, we're gonna have to have a whole big giant reserve of this stuff for when we're enchanting stuff. But for now, I think that was a very good use for that. We've got all of the. Oh my gosh! You know what? I'm not even waiting. I can't even do this. I was gonna to put some buttons on the roof, but I think it's time to go ahead and shear these sheep. So let's go ahead and head on over here. We're gonna do two things at once. We're gonna we're gonna get all this wool over here, and then before we even place this stuff, we're gonna go back inside. Oh, I should probably close that door first. We're gonna go back inside, and we're going to um we're gonna do the thing with the buttons. So we're gonna make some buttons on the crafting table, and then we're gonna go start placing stuff all over the place. Man, look at that. Oh, look at that. We've got 18 wool. All right, time to go see if this looks... Oh, man, I actually grew back enough. Grab that really quick. All right, none of you grow back before I get over here. You know how tempted it's going to be for me to turn around and grab your wool. So, we're going to go ahead. Oh, no, I grew back. Oh, man, they're everywhere. Okay, here we go. Don't grow back. We're good. Oh, you know what? We're leaving it. We're leaving it. We'll just come back whenever they're all grown in. But anyways, and that's actually really, really good. We have so many sheep that we can literally just stand there and shear them all day. But, oh, man, I've been, I've been waiting for this moment for so long. We're going to go ahead. Oh, I don't know what I'm going to do, actually, because... Uh, hold up, because I want to do like kind of like a little doorway kind of. I don't know what I'm gonna do. You know what? I believe at least the main part of the floor is gonna be um is gonna be blue wool. So we'll just go ahead and start putting some over here where our living room is gonna be. Bandit, you sit right there. Don't you dare jump in this hole. I know you like to do whatever you want, but you can't get in this hole. This isn't a swimming pool. This isn't. This isn't anything you could jump in. This is something that's super serious where we're gonna be putting our floor. So we're gonna go ahead and dig all this up really quick, and we're gonna put our floor inside of here. And eventually we are gonna have to go to the nether because uh, these torches just aren't cutting it We're gonna need to grab ourselves some glowstone and put it all up in the ceiling and stuff But anyways, we're gonna dig down I guess like a good little portion of this floor And then we're gonna go ahead and place this stuff where it needs to be We've got 25 hopefully we didn't dig too much stuff up over here But we're gonna place all these over here and then we're gonna make ourselves some wonderful buttons And we're just gonna add even more detail to this house than what has ever been added before Yeah, we actually dug up a little bit too much, but you know what? That's okay I'm imagining the entire floor is gonna be blue. So imagine that but everywhere <laughs> At least for the first floor I might do something different for the second floor I don't really know But anyways man It's time for us to go upstairs I've got some ideas with buttons Which we might actually have to go outside to do this But um You know what Yeah let's Oh wait hold up Wait a second hold up I think we could Let's see really quick Because I don't know if we actually made an access point Over here on the balcony to get out there Did we? 
I don't know if we did. I don't think we did. Um, yeah, so we're just gonna have to go from the outside and make a scaffolding. So, let's go ahead and make our buttons. I've got some ideas. You guys are probably already kind of assuming where I'll put the buttons. And I kind of got a good idea, so I wanna, I wanna go up there and I wanna place the buttons. But first things first, we're gonna have to make our buttons. So we're gonna need to go ahead and make one. Oh, it only makes one button at a time? That's actually pretty crazy. Alright, we're gonna make, I guess, four buttons? I don't think that's gonna be enough. We're gonna make, like, ten... 11, 12 buttons. Let's go with 12 buttons for now, and hopefully that'll be a good start. All right, Bandit, you're gonna sit in here. Actually, you know what, Bandit? We're gonna have you over here in your little room over here. I know it's not much right now. Maybe we'll spruce it up later on, but, um, or maybe we'll turn it into something else, but this is gonna be your temporary room for now, but Bandit, you're gonna stay right there. You're gonna just hang out in the house, and, uh, when it's nighttime, me and you are gonna go on a zombie killing spree, but for now, we're gonna go ahead and head on up here, and we're gonna put some buttons up here. Now, I don't quite know for sure where I should put my buttons. I do see the creeper there, so, uh, we have to be very, very careful. We're gonna go up here. We're gonna hopefully slay the creeper without it slaying us. It's the the plan. Oh, look how close we are. Oh, look how close we are. We have to be very careful. Creeper, don't even look at me. What are you doing, bro? Oh, we're gonna hit it. Oh, 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 hit it. Oh, don't blow up, please don't blow up. No! <laughs> Why? And I don't have. Oh, I do have some white wool. Never mind. I was gonna say I don't have any more white wool. Man, why did that have to happen? Why did the creeper? <laughs> I don't like creepers. I don't like creepers at all. That, I can't believe they blew up my house, man. That's not even... That's the meanest thing a creeper's ever done to me. All right, we're going to go upstairs really quick. You know what? Next time, we're not going to have mercy on the creepers. We're just going to... We're going to hit them with arrows from far away. That's what we're going to do. All right, so we're going to grab... Uh-oh. Uh-oh, we need dark oak, don't we? That's dark oak. This isn't spruce, is it? Hold up. Is this spruce? Is this spruce? Yeah, it is spruce. Aha! Wait a second. We don't have enough spruce. Oh, we do, but it's over there. Oh, man. All right, so we're going to... Is this spruce? I don't know if this is spruce. We're gonna have to chop it down. Let's see, is it spruce? Yes, it's spruce! Ha ha! We totally planned for this. Alright, we'll place this here. Place these back on over here. Man, I can't believe this got messed up so hard. Look at that. It's all, it's all messed up, man. But on the bright side, we've made it over here and we can start putting our buttons. Well, can we? Do we even have enough wool? I don't think we do. We don't even have enough white wool now. I can't believe this. Oh my gosh! Oh! I can't believe this will happen. And those are dark oak slabs. Do I have any more? Please say I do. Oh, yes, I do. All right, I'm so happy about that. Let's go back up and get stuff done. We're going up. We're not going to let this get to us. All we're going to need is a little bit of white wool. And um, then we can patch this up. So I'll place this here. Place this here. We still got that little bit of detail there. That little bit of detail there. And that little bit over there. So, you know what? Let's just, uh, oh, man, I missed the jump. Oh, it's because my hunger's down. Oh, man, we got to eat right now. Let's eat a bunch of carrots. We're going to do the whole healthy diet thing. We're going to eat all these delicious, delicious carrots. And we're just going to eat all of them. We're including the little green part of the carrot. We're just going to eat it all. Eat all the carrots. And we're not even going to care. We're going to eat all of it. There we go. All right. So, we're going to land as high up as we can. Though it doesn't hurt our hearts as much. Oh, this is the time. Oh, my gosh. Guys, 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 guys. Oh, the potion of healing. I can use it now. Yeah, look at that. I've been waiting to use that for so long. Oh, it, it didn't do that much, actually. Did it? I don't know if it did. I didn't really know if it did. But I used my potion. I'm so happy that I got to use my potion. But anyways, let's uh, let's grab Bandit. We're going to come out here. We're going to do a little bit of exploring. Because we do got to find ourselves a sheep. And we need to kill ourselves some more zombies. Because we are running low, low, low on zombie flesh. We've only got four zombie flesh. Come on out here, Bandit. Come on out. It's time for us to slay some zombies. And the zombies, they have no chance. That creeper over there, he had a chance. He blew us up because he's, he's just super, super evil. But zombies, oh, they have no chance against us. They're not going to be able to get us at all. What are you doing, wolf? What are you even mad at? I think there's something underground. Let's dig under here. Is there something under there? Oh, wait. This is where... Oh, this is where we did the thing, isn't it? So there's going to be a bunch of mobs under here, actually. There's probably, like, uh, skeletons and stuff underneath here. Oh, yeah. We patched it all up. So we can't even see it from over here. Oh, well. All right. So let's go ahead and... Uh, for those of you guys who probably don't know what I'm talking about, we're going to take a look over here so you guys can see. There's um, a big, giant area under here. It's probably got... Oh, my gosh. Look at it. It's a sheep! We only needed one sheep, and look what we got. We got a sheep. Well, actually, no. The second I say we need one sheep, we actually end up needing more sheep. But look at that. There's no mobs under here. We lit this thing up pretty good. And you know what? We could probably light it up even better just to make sure the, the last little bit of, uh, of uh, creepy crawlies don't actually come around. So we're going to light this up pretty good over here. You can see, look at this. This is nice terraforming I did. I'm so proud of this. We did so much today. But I do still have those buttons. Don't forget about those, Carnage. Don't forget about those. We got to do something with that. Add some more detail. Yes, the sheep went ahead and ate really quick. So let's shear them. I think our shears are actually going to break right here. Oh, nope. We still got a little bit left. Oh, yeah, we got four. Yay. Ha, 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 ha. We are good. We can go do the stuff that we need to do. We can put the wool back where it needs to be and we could get back to work on putting our buttons where we want our buttons to be bandit is that you you're not bandit where's bandit why is this oh look at him oh he was going crazy you saw him he's going evil oh my gosh oh get him get him bandit get him 
Oh, get him. Here, I'll shoot him. I'll shoot him. Oh, yeah. Oh, I hit Bandit. Oh, my gosh, Bandit. Come here. I got to give you a ride. Zombie flash. Oh, no. Come here, Bandit. Don't come over here. Oh, let's come here. Oh, don't blow up. Oh, yeah. Oh, Bandit, don't get near him. Bandit, don't get near him. I already hit you with an arrow on accident. Get out of here, Creeper. Oh, yeah. You can't even take me out like that. We're going to grab this wool. We're going to grab the mutton. And then we're going to feed our wonderful dog some delicious. You're not my dog. You're my dog. There you go. Have yourself some delicious rotten zombie flesh. There you go, buddy. Oh, I just gave him all of it. Man, we're all the way out of zombie flesh. Are you kidding me? Oh, there's a creeper. Oh, oh, this isn't good. This isn't good. We've got too many creepy crawlies this time. They're going way, way, way too hard right now. We've got to... We're coming inside, bandit. We're taking a snooze. I'm not liking this. I'm not liking this thing right now. Nope, nope, nope. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, cook ourselves some mutton. Oh, we got potatoes for days. Look at that. Oh, man, that's crazy. Um, let's put... Ah, there we go. There's a place we can put some mutton. And, um, I guess, you know what? We're gonna work through the night. Bandit, you're sitting in here because I don't want you to get hurt. And, um, I I'm okay with being out here. I just don't want Bandit to get hurt because we don't have any more rotten zombie flesh for him. So, anyways, we're gonna go ahead and head on up here with our completely messed up thing at this point. And we, we really should have made, like, a staircase instead of, like, these weird just kind of platforms right here. Because psh, we've made three of them so far. Just get up here. All right. Anyway, so, we've got here... And I think, if I'm not mistaken, I think we have plenty of wool to go ahead and patch this up. Everything's good in the world. We're going to pretend that this whole never, ever happened. And now we can actually grab these buttons and do something with them. So I'm thinking, oh, no. Oh, I completely just noticed something. We completely messed up the uh, the oak leaves doing that. So we're going to jump back over here and uh, attempt to put these back where they need to be. So I'll put one here if we can. Wait, do we have to go? There we go. I'll put one there. And um, I'm going to have to kind of do a little weird jumpy jump. To get around here. Oh, I don't need leaves for that one. I just need another dark oak slab. There we go. All of this just to add a little bit more detail. And I'm thinking what I should probably do is go ahead and add a button, I guess, right here. Right here. And then one more on the other side over here. And then I should probably go to the front of the house and add some more kind of kind of like that around the leaves and stuff like that. Now, that's not the last bit of detail that I plan to do. I do plan to put, like, planters and stuff on the side, like with... um. Oh, actually, we do have flower pots already, but we don't have the flowers for it. I want to put all of the, um, I think they're called blue orchids. I want to put all of the blue orchids. I think that's what they're called. And I want those to be all over my house. And I want to have, like, some red flowers kind of around my house so that I could, um, have, like, a little bit of contrast thing going on. So I've got plans. Oh, there we go. Speaking of plans, I'm planning to take this zombie out. Come here, Mr. Zombie. You can't take me out. I am the master of zombie slaying. Oh, my gosh. Hold up. There's an egg. Oh, my goodness. There we go. All right. We got the egg that we needed. But one thing we need even more than eggs, and that is some delicious, nutritious baked potatoes. Look at this. This is yummy. Oh, look at that. Look at all that stuff he dropped over there. What even killed him? I don't even know what killed him. Did we kill him? I don't know. Maybe Bandit killed him whenever he was over here before. Maybe that's where he ran off to. But anyway, so let's uh, let's see what we could do here. We have a full inventory. We need to put some stuff up real quick. And then we can get some more work done out here. Now, I need to check to see if I have any of these blue flowers. That's the one I'm talking about. Whatever that one is. We need to find one of those. I don't know if we have any more. But we might. We might just have some. So we're going to look really quick. I see I have Poppy. And I have uh, some whatever this is called. And I also have more poppy, and I have sunflower. So we don't have the flower I want yet. So I think we're going to have to take a trip to the swamp. But anyways, let's go ahead and um, I guess we can kind of work on doing the whole button thing. But we need to put some stuff up really quick, just in case we collect more stuff on our way. So we'll put up the carrots that we don't need right now. Put up the wheat that we don't need right now. We can put up the oak leaves, because apparently we don't need those right now. At least I don't think so. We can put up the sugar canes. We can put up the... Actually, let's hang on to the bricks, because we're needing a lot of flower pots. And we'll also put up the egg, and we'll hang on to the shears, put up the glass bottle... And I think we're good. I think we're good on that. So, we're going to head on out here and we're going to get some more detail added. Now, I know these are just like tiny details, but I think really, honestly, the tiny details is what makes houses very, very good. So, the House of Carnage, we don't want it to just be all right. We want it to be very, very good. So, we're going to make sure that we do all the little bitty details that we don't necessarily have to do. But I think we should do it just to kind of, just kind of make it look as good as we could possibly make it. So, we're going to go ahead and chop these down really quick. And then we're going to go to the other side. Now, we might do something a little bit different for the back side. Now, these triangle things, they're all the same shape. They're all kind of, you know, pretty much the same. But I think I might do a little bit different detail than, than what I'm doing right here. So, the uh, the back triangle bit, I'll show you guys what I'm talking about in just a second. We're going to hold off on that one. And we might do a little bit different things with the, with the detail for that. So, what I mean by that is let's uh, come on right on over here. And as you can tell, we've got buttons like right there next to the little um, next to the little bushes that are kind of on the side. But and then um, over here, we also have buttons next to the bushes. They're a little bit different. And then on the back over here, what I want to do 
what I want to do is I want to do it a little bit different. Maybe, oh my goodness, there's a zombie. You know what? I'm glad I saw you, zombie, because I've been needing some zombie flesh for sure. You don't have any zombie flesh either, man. We are running low on zombie flesh. But anyways, let's go ahead and head on back over here. I think it's time for Bandit to come out and play. We're going to kill any more remaining zombies on our way on over to go grab a little bit more of that delicious, delicious blue wool. Because <laughs> we're going to eat blue wool for the rest of our lives. No, we're not doing that, Bandit. That's crazy talk. But anyways, we're going to go ahead and run on out here. Bandit, if you see anything. Oh, where'd you go? Bandit. Oh, Bandit, if you see anything suspicious, you bark and you tell me, okay, Bandit? We're gonna head on over here, and we're gonna try to find some stuff. We're gonna get some stuff, we're gonna get some things, and I think, if I'm not mistaken, my shears are, like, just seconds away from breaking. You know what, Bandit? I'll let you take him out. Go ahead. Go ahead, Bandit. You can you have fun. Eat his bones. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and... Oh, my gosh! Wow, look at this. All right, my shears are gonna break any second now. Here we go. Oh, there they go. All right, so we're gonna... Head on out here. We don't really have uh, any iron on us. Or do we? Yeah, we do, actually. Let's uh, make ourselves a new pair of shears. Why not? There we go. All right. And we're going to shear a little bit more. You, you're, Get back in there, you crazy sheep. Get back in there. We're going to close the door really quick. And we're going to shear the rest of these sheepy sheep. So we're going to take this wool, this wool right here. And we're leaving this place. We're not going to look back because I know you guys are going to eat some grass. And there's going to be even more. So we're not even going to look at that. So we got 24 more wool. I guess it's time for us to go back inside and start putting the blue wool where the blue wool needs to be. So we're going to get right on inside here. Bandit, again, if you see anything crazy, you let me know because I want anything attacking us. But anyways, we're going to go ahead and uh, start kind of filling this out a little bit more here. We've got 24. So that's 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 10 holes so far. So we can go ahead and sit Bandit down. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, and 24. So we should have just enough blue wool to fill every last little hole up right here. I wanted to make sure I counted it because I didn't want to leave any random holes around. Because I want to actually put some torches down to kind of keep the mobs at bay. Even though eventually we're going to have some legit lights in the ceiling and stuff. For now, we could just go ahead and toss some torches on the ground and just call it a day. But look at that. We've got at least got our carpet started. Everything is looking great in the world. Make sure we have more than enough torches laying around here. And um, I do believe at this point, man, that we could go back outside. And we can go do some more stuff. So I think what I should probably do is I should probably um, look around really quick. Actually, you know what? Oh, I got an idea, but I don't know if I have, the, if I have stuff for doing. Alright, so we're gonna we're gonna look really quick. Let's see if I have it. Come on, please say I do. We have it's gonna be a decorations, and it's gonna be right here. Alright, so we need sticks and leather. If we have some leather, we can do my diabolical plan, which we totally do. So I'm gonna make myself some sticks really quick. I don't know how many I'm going to need, so I'm just going to go ahead and make, like, 25 of them. And then we're going to go ahead and make, uh, three of these, I think. We're going to do one, two, three. Oh, and we need to do three on the other side, too. We completely forgot to do the other side, so we're going to make a bunch more sticks. And then we're going to go ahead and make, uh, three more of these. There we go. And how many buttons do we have left? We've got five buttons. All right, we've got plenty of buttons, Bandit. We've got everything that we're going to need. So, if I'm not mistaken, we could just go ahead and have you sit right on inside there. We're going to close the door. Because I'm going to come up on... I don't want you climbing on the roof, Bandit. I don't I don't have enough zombie flesh to kind of keep you keep you fed and stuff if you do get hurt. So, I'm going to try to keep you safe until I get some, uh, until I get some more stuff. So, anyways, we're going to go ahead and head on up here really quick. And if I'm not mistaken, I should have enough buttons to do this detail... And not only that, I'm going to add an extra layer of detail that I think is going to be super, super awesome. So, we're going to put this right... Uh-oh, did I put it... I think I put it underneath, didn't I? Yeah, I put it like that. Alright, guys, get ready for this. Let's see if this detail works. Alright, so we're going to grab this item frames. And then we're going to do is we're going to put it under there. Oh, look at that! That's looking sweet! Oh, man, that adds, like, so much detail. It's crazy talk. Alright, we'll break that. And then we'll go ahead and break our way all the way down... And then from here, we got to go back up to the other side, and we got to do that detail on there. And then we'll be good for today. We've got so much stuff done. The only thing to, left to do from here is to kind of go to the Wall of Carnage and see who's on it. And it's going to be one of you guys from leaving comments in the last episode. So we're going to definitely go check on that here in just a moment. But let's go up and add this extra little bit of detail. Now, I don't think I'm going to do this for the front because I think the sides just need that extra little bit of detail. Considering, um, you know, it's kind of like they started out as these big, giant, like, wool kind of flat places or whatever but I think how we're doing it now I think it's kind of breaking it up and making it just look so much more detailed I think we're gonna end up doing a little bit more detail such as um, 
putting like a planter right there and another one right there on that side and then um, doing the same thing on the other side and then we'll do like little window planters around all the windows or something like that but anyways let's go ahead and head on over to the wall of carnage and we're gonna see who has been added today but first before we do that we can't go to the wall of carnage on an empty stomach so we're gonna eat ourselves some of these delicious delicious baked potatoes there we go all right so bad it's time for us to go see who is on the wall of carnage today so here we go. Let's see. Joining us on the wall of cards today is... Evan Fuller. So congratulations, Evan, on making it onto the Wall of Carnage. Now remember, guys, if you want to make it onto the Wall of Carnage, all you gotta do is leave some comments down in the comment section below, and I'll be choosing one lucky person each and every episode. But with that said, guys, I've been Carnage the Creator. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, be sure to go ahead and leave a like on it. Let's try to go ahead and get to 200 likes. And if you are one of the first 200 people to like this video, let me know down in the comment section below. But I've been Carnage the Creator. Catch you guys in the next video. Video, and I'm out. Carnage the Creator. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're watching Carnage the Creator. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're watching Carnage the Creator. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're watching Carnage the Creator. Creator, Creator. Yeah. yeah.